welcome and wish well to Japanese peace walkers who are walking from this location about to about six miles to where Indian Point is. I got involved in the effort to close Indian Point in February of 2000 after the plant had a problem where a pipe exploded and radioactive water spilled into directly into the Hudson River. I have been to very active nuclear power plant over 30 years and I always walk to the different nuclear power plant, nu nu nuclear weapon station because the situation kill everybody, kill not only human or species or everybody. I, I said, let's walk. So many people just show up amazingly, you know, that this is not Buddhist people. It's just where they are, just come to together and walking together. We're here with the Buddhists and the Muslims and the Jews and the Christians, people of all faiths, because we share both a joy in creation, a love of creation, but an understanding of our responsibility to the creation as well. And we know that one of the biggest uh, threats to creation is nuclear power. So the Indian Point plant behind me, uh, 38 years old, well, this plant is located in a place where 20 million Americans live within 50 miles, the evacuation zone of a plant like this. So it has a higher risk in that sense, in terms of more people being exposed to any failure in the plant. Secondly, it's same technology as the Fukushima plants. We know it sits on a fault zone, uh, not overly active, but certainly not entirely dormant. So the risks that it presents are very real, and the number of people that are at risk because of uh, its presence is, are enormous. I was at home when earthquake hit, so it was a big shake. I never experienced that kind of earthquake before, so I was very su surprised and shocked. And then we heard that there will be a big tsunami coming, so we are very afraid. Major tsunami has struck northeastern Japan. I love this Earth, this planet. This is our mother, Mother Earth. And what's happening in Fukushima and all the radiation spreading out the Mother Earth, contaminating the Mother Earth, and I feel really bad about it. And so joining this walk is part of my prayer for Mother Earth. If we believe that this whole universe is a manifestation of God, manifestation of the Buddha, manifestation of the divine self, then this whole world is so precious. But through this beautiful land, we, we have so much poison, the, uh, the poison of uh, nuclear material last tens of thousands of years. Who has right to this, give this, you know, poison to the generations after generations? This is just crazy, insane. Faith does call us into action, especially uh, to confront evil and sin. Uh, we understand that uh, much of what we're suffering from is the abuses of, of greed. It is uh, a, uh, an abuse of human dignity, uh, an abuse of human rights for the purposes of profit at the expense of people. Shut them down. Buddhism, fast teaching, non-violence, non-fight, non-killing. I very respect Gandhi. And Gandhi said, my message is my life. My life is my message, meaning just action, not just talk, talk, talk. So if I too much talk, no meaning, <laughs> more action. <laughs> so thank you. Namu myoho renge kyo. Namu myoho renge kyo.